Vito, hey, how you doing? Shh, no, 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 no. I just wanted to give you the money to pay off Papa's debt. Oh, Vito, that's great. I was gonna try and see if we could pay it back in installments. I got a little money. He wouldn't have hurt us. Don't be so sure, but it doesn't matter now. Yeah. Where'd hey. you get all this money, Vito? You haven't done nothing you'll be sorry for, have hey, you? Don't worry. Everything's fine. Thank you, Vito. Thank no you. No problem. All right, look, I better be going. I, I don't want Ma to see me. She'll be asking where I got the money, too. Don't worry. I'll make something up. All right. Give her a big kiss for me, I will. okay? Take care of yourself, Vito. Vito Scaletta? Yeah? What's it to you? You're under arrest for the illegal distribution of federal ration stamps. You're coming with us. One of the gas station attendants ratted me out. The guy fingered me and they strung on Mama into telling him where I was staying. But they had no idea who I was working for and I wasn't about to tell them. Henry was able to get me a lawyer, courtesy of his boss, Clementi. I was up Shit's Creek, but at least I had a battle. Could have been a hell of a lot worse if the Feds knew and about I any of my other activities. to be even more serious, considering the fact that you stole national resources at a time when our country needs them the most. 
an axe the gravity of which you, Mr. Skeletor. The guy was good, but even he couldn't get me out of this one. It was a lost cause from day one. Three months later, they handed down the verdict. Vittorio Antonio Scaletta, for your crimes against the people of this city and of this great country, this court hereby sentences you to 10 years in a federal penitentiary. Murderers, child molesters, they are all here. The worst of the worst. All right, get in line, gentlemen. Follow me, single file. And no monkey business, or else. Problems, you son of a bitch! I, I'm sorry. What's the matter? No speaking to English? Here, let me teach you. What do you enjoy this, you sick fuck? Now, get your ass up and get no. back in line. <laughs> no. no. Hey, smart ass, don't make me repeat myself. Back in line. Move it! Stop right there. Turn to your right. Your other right. Listen up, assholes. My name is Captain Terrence Stone, and this is my prison. You're here on the inside because you can't behave like normal human beings on the outside. Make no mistake. Your ass belongs to me now, and you'll do what I say, or you'll be sorry that you did it! Fuck with me, and I'll fuck with your sorry ass all day long! You were sent here to be rehabilitated, and rehabilitate you? We will. Okay, you assholes. We're gonna cut you loose. Just long enough to get you cleaned up. Now get in line and follow me. Welcome to the salon, ladies. You're gonna look just fucking beautiful. Hey, me too? I ain't got nothing on my head to cut. Shut your face, cue ball. Okay, let's go. Hey, shit for brains. Do what you're fucking told. Listen, freak boy. If you ain't gonna do what you're told, we're gonna stick you in the hole. Follow me. Welcome home. Get in. Lights out! And be quiet, assholes! You know what's good for you.
This was gonna be my new home for the next ten years. Look like shit and smell like piss. I would have preferred dodging bullets in Europe to this. After three action-packed days of staring at the wall, I got a message from Joe to contact a guy named Leo Galante, who could supposedly help me out in here. This wasn't the kind of place where you could survive on your own. I'm looking for Leo Galante. Buzz off, asshole. Excuse me, you know where Leo Galante is? Leave me the fuck alone. I'm looking for Leo Galante. I got nothing to say to you. I'm looking for Leo Galante. Hey, buddy. Beat it. One thousand eight hundred and seventy. Excuse me, you know where Leo Galante is? Get the fuck away from me. Seventy-six days. I'm looking for Leo Galante. Hey, buddy, beat it. Six more days in this shithole until I get out. You're counting it in days? How much is it in years? Two? Well, there's 365 days in a year. So if it were just two years, that would be, uh, 730 days. So how many years then? I ain't too good with arithmetic. <sighs> Five years and almost two months. How long for you? They should let me out next summer. Lucky uh, bastard. Hey, uh, I'm looking for uh, Leo Galante. You know where I can find him? Yeah, yeah. Old guy. Plays chess all day. One thousand eight hundred and seventy fucking six. What? Eighteen hundred and seventy six days. The record gonna be yours, man. Six more days in this shithole. Look at this scrawny motherfucker. Ain't no way she's gonna do this. No chance. No chance to survive. Oh, your base. Ming Ti Chiu Kung Fu. The war. I've seen game lately. War is just beginning. Oh, you're hey, miss. Hello, Willis. I was wondering. I know you. You're that fucking guinea who was with Barbara in a jewelry store. I'm in this fucking hellhole because of you. You got locked up because you're a stupid, crazy fuck. <laughs> you know, fellas, my mom was right. There is a god! <laughs> sent you here, you Genny bastard, so that I could pay you back! Yeah. Oh. This looks interesting. Wanna make a small bet? Yeah. I'm gonna break you, Dave! Come on, you bloody yeah. talk. This is gonna be easier. <laughs> Pick his teeth in! Oh, skinny little faggots like you for breakfast! You eat faggots for breakfast? Kill him, O'Neill! Step back! Okay, Did you hear me? Break it Get out, out of here! Both of you should in the hole! We're gonna give you a little time to think about what you've done. Close it up. So O'Neill almost took my head off, but I made a stand. Let me tell you something, when you're inside, it counts for a lot more than you might think. How long are you planning on keeping him in here? Long enough to learn his lesson. That's gonna have to change. He ain't in any shape to fight. 
Should be. Boys didn't knock him around too bad after the brawl in the yard. All right, open it up. Rise and shine, Scaletta. You got yourself a visitor. My name is Leo Galante. I heard you wanted to speak to me. Yeah. Uh, one of Clemente's guys said I should contact you. Said maybe you could help me out. Oh, fuck Clemente. I don't provide protection for his guys in here. But I saw how you handled that mick who's after you, O'Neill. You could prove useful. Come with me, boy. <clears throat> now listen up, fellas. This is Vito. He's gonna be helping us out. Peppy here's got a big fight coming up. Against O'Neill. He needs a sparring partner. And from what I saw of you out there in the yard, you're just the man for the job. You're gonna help us out, kid. In return, you'll be under my protection. And who knows, maybe you'll even learn a thing or two along the way. I guess I can't say no to that offer, huh? I don't remember asking. All right, fellas. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, today we're gonna work on your counterpunching. Vito, I want you to hit Pepe. Try and bust that big jaw of his. Pepe, you avoid the punch like I showed you. Then use that momentum to throw a punch of your own. All right, fellas. Let's get going. a boy, Pepe. Keep that oversized chin of yours down, damn it. Ah. Footwork, Pepe. Remember your footwork. It's good. Whoa! Would you look at that? Hey! We supposed to be sparring or training? Change of plans, big fella. This kid's got fire in him. So now you're both gonna practice your counter punches. All right, Vito. See if you can do that again. It's a handy tool to have in the box, huh? Most guys ain't gonna see it coming. Peppy here. <laughs> he ain't most guys, though. Nice, kid. Nice. nice Give one. Me two more of those. All right, one Shit, more. That had to hurt. Ah. There you go. You're a fast learner, kid. All right, fellas. That's enough for today. Nice work. So, how close did you get to Clemente, Vito? Actually, I never met him. I always dealt with either Henry Tomasino or Luca Garino. Huh. I can't believe that cocksucker Garino's still breathing. What was your deal with him? Well, you know, we did a couple jobs for him, and, uh... Luca said he'd bring us into the family for, uh, five grand. What? Typical fucking Alberto. He's always been a crooked bastard. Uh... So what is that, like, more than usual? Yeah. Like five grand more than usual. You don't gotta pay to get in, Vito. You're brought into the family once you prove that you're loyal, a good earner. And he can handle... <laughs> you know, the life. In any case, this is an interesting piece of news. When this gets out, Alberto and Luca are gonna have a lot of explaining to do. To who? Jeez. Don't worry about that. We'll talk about it some other time. Come on, give me another 20. Yeah, that's it. Watch where you walk, Guaylo. Maybe if your eyes were all the way open, you would have seen me coming, asshole. Galante. Crooked white devil. Nice to see you too, Mr. Wu. Crooked? You bet on your own guy and he lost. That's the way it works in this country. Then Wu offer you a rematch. I think I can arrange that. You up to it, Vito? Chinaman, huh? Yeah, get him a stepladder and send them over. All right, Wu. Looks like you got yourself a rematch. And none of that chop suey crap this time. Now listen, these chinks are quick little bastards. No point in throwing big punches early on. You'll never connect. All right. What am I supposed to do then? You hit him quick and tire him out. When he's weak, he'll put his guard down. Then you swing for the fences. Now get out there and show him what you're made of. Hey, does Vito get a fortune cookie after eating your guy for breakfast? <laughs> ah. Ah. That's the top. 
快点打死他！我要踢他，快踢他！就是这样，带他，打他，打他！哎呀 ，Shut up, study more！ 对对，就是个那样子，刀子刀子，他一就是个那样子，对，快点踢呀，快点踢！Let's go, Skeletta. You're late for work. Hey, listen. Vito here's got the day off, courtesy of Mr. Galante. Gotcha. Don't get used to it, Scaletta. All right. Come with me, Vito. What, are we gonna train some more? Uh, sorta. You'll see. Morning, kid. Morning, Mr. Galante. Why no training today? Not exactly. We got a challenge from the Spooks, and I don't want to risk Peppy getting all banged up before his big fight with O'Neill. So I want you to take this one. It'll be good practice for you. Come on. Now, the guy you're gonna be fighting is a strong bastard, but he ain't too bright. Fights with his heart, not his head. You piss him off, you lower his guard. That's when you let him have it. All right, here we go. Make me proud, kid. Looky here. I'ma take this skinny ass white boy to school. Gonna hit him so hard his mama's mama gonna feel it. Hope you meatballs getting ready to lose. Or come on, my grandmama hit me hotter than that. Hey, win or lose, it'll probably be the hardest work this bum had in his life. Your little cracker going down. Yeah, that's the way to do it, my brother. Let's go, Vito. Put these bums back in their place. Oh, this boy got as much chance of winning as a brother running for president. Don't worry, Vito. You got him right where you want him. Oh, no, you no, grab him. Now's your chance, kid. Knock him in the next one. All barking, no bite, just like last time, right? Hell of a job, kid. Hell of a job. Here's your cut, Vito. You earned it. Yo, one of the hacks is coming. What the hell is this? Some kind of circle jerk? All right, come on, Scaletta. You got a visitor. Hey! Hi, Vito. Hey, Frankie. How you doing? I'm doing good. Real good. Thanks. So, uh, how's things? Well... I, I got something to tell you. I'm getting married, Vito. Oh, Maron, that's great. I mean, it would have been nice if he asked my permission first, but... Hey, I'm happy for you. Vito, you're in jail. Look at yourself. Uh, how'd you let this happen? Hey, I already got a lecture from the judge, huh? I don't need another one. Just... just drop it, all right? Vito, there's something else. It's Mama. What do you mean? What about her? She's sick, Vito. She's been like this for weeks and she's not getting any better. Look, Frankie. Go to Joe's. He's holding on to my money for me. You get her the best doctor you can find. And, uh... You keep the rest as a wedding gift. Vito... No, no, I mean it. Looks like I'm not gonna need it for a while. Alright, looks like I gotta go. Uh, 
Look, you take care of Ma. Tell her I love her. I will. And thanks, Vito. Bye. Let's go, Scaletta. Those turlets ain't gonna clean themselves. Thank <laughs> you.